Overall, what has these 25 fall games shown you about the 2012-2013 Lady Hornets? Um, the first portion of the season really um, gave us a good look at to what our potential for the season could be. Um, the girls put in a lot of work in the offseason, um, so the success that we've had has been really good, but it also shows us where our opportunities for improvement going into the main portion of our season. Having a young team for a freshman, two juniors, one sophomore. What does this team bring new to the table that you haven't seen in the past? Um, this team brings an intense desire, um, a focus, um, the, the, the want to win, the drive to win, both academically and on the lanes. Moving forward, what are you looking for forward to most when the season resumes? Um, I'm looking forward mostly to seeing the improvement that the girls are uh, in the effort that they're putting out. Um, just the continued drive that they have, to continue to be better. Getting into our main portion of the season, now is when these things need to start come to a gel. Being at a break right now, um, what are your emphasis right now for the ladies? Um, over the break, just hoping that they're practicing and their individual strength and conditioning. Uh, how are the girls preparing mentally right now? Um, mentally, we're in practice, we put them in situations where they're not normally going to see in, the, in game time situations. We put that stress on them in practice so that they know how to handle it when the game time comes. Being able to host ASU's first bowling tournament and placing second in it, how did you feel about that? I, I was really proud of the ladies. Um, it was an affirmation of all the hard work that they did um, getting ready for the tournament, but it also shows them the potential that they have if they keep working hard, if they keep pushing, if they keep driving, and keep that intense desire to win. It really shows them that they're not going to have any limits. The early preseason rankings came out, um, being ranked top in the top 20. How does that make you feel as a coach and as a leader? Um, the top 20 ranking made me feel real good, but at the same time, for the ladies, it showed them that their hard work um, is paying off. Now, it's just a portion of what they wanted to do this year, what their goals were, but it shows them that they can do it, and they just got to keep working hard to, to improve and get better.